while I was searching for center caps for my replacement rims, I came across these black badges and it gave me the idea for replacing my original badges, which I do like, but replacing them with badges painted entirely in carbon flash. These were only $20 on Amazon and they're, they're fairly fair quality. So I'm going to give it a shot painting these. And if they turn out well, I'm going to replace the uh, three original badges with the, with the ones from Amazon. This is a convertible. So the waterfall also has a badge on it. This is a list of material for painting the badges. I have the four badges, some painter's tape, rubber gloves, isopropyl, isopropyl alcohol for cleaning the badges before I use the etching primer, the, the paint, which is carbon flash, AC Delco. I also have some clear coat. I'll spray one or two coats of that on top. I have some acetone for cleaning the, the spray tips between each, each coat and some rags. The process I'm using to paint the badges is to start with the painter's tape to cover the back of the badges. The badges have double-sided tape and I don't want to deteriorate the adhesive on the double-sided tape. Then I'll clean the badges with isopropyl alcohol, apply two coats of self-etching primer. You might be wondering why I'm not going to sand the badges. If you look close, there's intricate detail on the badges and any sanding would just remove those details. After the primer, I'll apply two coats of the carbon flash paint and one or two coats of clear coat. This is the first coat of primer. I shook the pan for one minute as directed by the instructions. All right, this is the second coat of the primer. I put on two pretty light coats, so I decided to do a third coat of the primer.
I changed up my spray area. I missed a couple of spots on the back sides of the, or on the tops of the badges. So I cut the box up so I could get around to the other side. So I'm gonna put a little bit more on, on the parts that I missed. The first coat of the face paint. So after the primer, I let the primer sit for about half an hour before I did this first coat. And I'll probably let this sit for cure for about half an hour before I do a second coat. But even on the first coat, the metal flake is uh, looks pretty good. All right, this is the second coat of the carbon flash. The first coat went on pretty thick, so this may only take two coats. I have a change of plans. After the second coat of the AC Delco carbon flash paint, I noticed the metal flake on this paint isn't doesn't match the the paint that's already on the car. So I'm going to look for some additional paint that uh, that contains that's black gloss and contains metal flake and see if I can get a better match. So I'll probably do some test sprays when I locate some paint or I may have some some custom paint mixed up to take care of this. The next segment will will be that those test sprays to, to see if I can find paint that matches. <laughs> 